How are you feeling? Deathly ill. <laughs> this is the perfect place though when you don't. Oh, Teddy, are you with Vicky? The hounds are happy because the big hounds are outside. Oh my Over goodness. Well, Hamilton and Teddy and I drove to Victoria's horse show last night. We met up with Victoria and her parents and then we drove the rest of the way up to Vermont to their house. Didn't film any of it. I was so tired. I didn't feel good last night. I thought I was gonna die actually. <laughs> didn't just sitting in the car for seven hours because the traffic was horrible. But it's worth it because now the dogs are here. Hamilton's in heaven. Don't you, Teddy? Okay, what's the plan for today? First, we're gonna go to the farmer's market and get these really good maple syrup donuts. And then we come back here, do some work on the property. Biff hasn't mowed his lawn for, I think, six months. And he's really excited to get back on his John Deere. Might be some wood chopping, some wood stacking. It's raining today. So we'll hike tomorrow. Yeah. But that'll be good because the dogs hate the car so much. So we will really exhaust them. <laughs> favorite house I think in the entire universe. Oh my hair. What is happening? What is this? Okay, we are going to the farmer's market to get a few things. Fiddleheads. We hope they're not sold out. I kind of wish they are. <laughs> they're very weird. It's a fern that gets pickled the best thing ever. I'm glad it's, the rain held off a bit. They're not sold out. Yeah, Spicy and not. Two things of green tomatoes and horsey crap thrown in for free. Was it good? They're delicious. Mm -hmm. The best donuts in the world. Tied with Downy Flake. This is two weekends in a row of good donuts. <laughs> So good. We can't wait any longer. We're about to eat the donuts. They're so good. They're so good. My parents will only vacation in places with really good donuts, which is here in Downey Flake. Thank you, Mom and Dad. Mm. Uh oh. <laughs> it just melts in your mouth. It's so light and They fluffy. really do melt in your mouth. How do they get the outside like this? It's just a glaze? Maple glaze. The amazing thing is, they're so light, you can eat like six per person. Not sure if that's a good thing or a bad thing. <laughs> This is one of my favorite parts about coming here. Stack. We did this last year. I don't know, there's something therapeutic about it. Just methodical. Ready for winter. Look at that. 
Oh God. Very unstable. We almost just had a huge issue. Now we are off to try to get the dogs to get a little bit more tired, even though they're already exhausted. So we're doing a little loop of a walk. We did it earlier today. I had no idea where we were going, and all of a sudden we ended up back at the front of their house. And I said, Oh my god, Victoria, Hamilton's in someone else's garage. And she goes, Uh, that's our house. And I was like, Wait, how did we get back here? And there we were, right in the front. It's a convenient loop. Can you go in, Ted? We'll do it together. Can you do it? Good boy, you can do it. Hop, big jump. Big jump. Okay. Ham's doing it. Right here. Right here. Right below. Right below. Jump, Ted. <laughs> Needs a little assistance. Good boy. We're gonna stack some more wood. Help. Yeah. No more wheelbarrow. We were, we were just saying it's like very satisfying work because you can really see your progress. Like you can actually see like a dent being made. Every load. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we got a lot of that stack done, and then this stack, too. Ah. Ham's got the stick. Get it, Teddy. Get the stick. Come on. Okay, it is now Sunday morning, and we thought it would be a little clearer, but it's still raining. We are headed to go for a hike. We hope it doesn't rain. I don't think it's going to. I think it's just going to be like cold and dreary. Really wet. But the dogs are pumped. They're already filthy. The other dogs are in the other car. Oh my gosh, little guy. We're no just one getting else started. Is as crazy as us. It's kind of drizzly. already taken off quite a few layers <laughs> down tank to a tank top down. shirt shedding more layers <laughs> we way overdressed it's not that cold Hi, princesses. the update is that I'm half dead it's brutal never trust this one to bring you up a mountain no, never <laughs> she'd climb Mount Kilimanjaro yeah don't worry this is like so easy that last little bit was hard. It was. It was very steep. Really hard. The dogs are hanging in there, surprisingly. Okay. 
I have no idea why I let Victoria talk me into this. Oh my god. I actually think I'm dead. My legs feel like jello. <laughs> we gotta carry Hamilton up a little bit. <laughs> we wrapped little Hamilton up in the Patagonia. He's okay, buddy. Final update from the car after that hike. Never doing it again. <laughs> it was so hard. These are cute little Muppets in the back. They're what? They look really pathetic. They're tired. Come here, little guys. You want bats? Oh man, that was hard. Okay. We're sadly leaving. We've got the dogs in the back seat. I'm hoping that they are exhausted from that hike. If they're half as tired as I feel right now, they should be asleep as soon as we hit the road, basically. Victoria is inside of the little red hen getting us coffee and a couple of snacks for the road. Hopefully some things to keep us warm. Best. Oh, I can't wait, thank you. Get ourselves some 